All right, what is up my friends? Welcome to Mod Monday. The show where I play goblins every single Monday. This is episode 136. Last week was modern. It was modern sacrifice goblins. That was cool. I'm gonna work on that one more. So you watch you missed that one, go watch it on YouTube, of course. But today, 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 today is uh historic. Just going back to our Muxus thing. We haven't played Muxus in a while. We've been playing a lot of different stuff. We played uh, we tried Explorer Goblins, we some Commander, we played some modern again, but we're just going back to the old Muxus roots here. Nothing crazy here. Nothing crazy. Just when I thought I was out, they pulled me back in. And there we go. So that's Muxus time. Nothing crazy here. It's a basic Rakdos Goblins deck. If I were to play Rakdos Goblins in Historic, this is the exact list that I would play. Uh, that's it. There's no more, no no craziness today. Just a solid, solid Goblin deck in Historic. Let's see how good it is. Brought to you by... Cool Stuff Inc. is proud to sponsor Jim Davis. We offer great deals on card games, tabletop RPGs, board games, and more. Get a free token featuring Jim Davis and take 5% off your next order if you use the code JIM5 at checkout. CoolStuffInc.com. Cool stuff in stock. All right. Let's go. Mog Monday. Let's do the thing. Let's cast Muxus. And let's cast Muxus again. And then let's cast Muxus again. We like that. We like that. All right. Um, Alarmobot in chat. Are you the Alarmobot that built the last deck we played? Uh, this isn't great. We can keep this. Just another Mog Monday. Cranko Token Fun Day. All right. Odawar, the Soaring City Moon Snare Prototype. Chat. What's up? Where's my ads, too? I turned off the ads off while we were doing the uh, I have my music thing on. Where is it? Boom. There it is. Yes. Here comes the money. <laughs> yes. That, that, that was your deck, actually. That deck's awesome. That deck's awesome. Super cool. Super cool. Happy your sub, Alarma Bot. That's great. I think it's really, really cool. Historic's great. I think Historic's a great format. Like, I know everyone's all pumped about Alchemy right now. Not Alchemy. Yeah, Alchemy, yeah. Everyone's pumped about Alchemy. Everyone's pumped about Explorer right now, but... All right, the old Tormont script is here. So we have Blue-White Affinity. They probably have the mana leak in which is very bad against us. And we didn't draw land. Crap. All right. Well, we're just going to kill this and attack for one. All right. Let's take that out. Coming in. So we need lands. Uh, Mux, like, of course, needs lands. We are 45% draw land. A nettle cyst is here. We have trash. We have trash master in our board. So, because he, God damn it, All right, whatever. All right, we're in trouble. There's a war chief, but can say go. Yeah. Leggings asks: Is it easier to build a deck solo and then get input from other people, or to build the deck from the ground up in collaboration? I think it's better to just build the deck by yourself at first and then get collaboration later. All right, so here's another nettle cyst and a thought monitor. Uh, yeah, we can't we can't miss land drops this game, folks. Uh, we've not missed our land drop, what, two turns in a row, three turns in a row, and we're just dead. So, what are you gonna do? Uh, we draw like land, land, maybe. Opponents doing their thing. We draw land. It is a canyon slew. It's not an ideal land, but we can mons here, block, block, shoot the monitor. The problem is they can just move these things over and kill me. I probably should have blocked last turn, actually. Yeah, I'm just dead, actually. Whatever. That's not, we can't win anyway. It doesn't matter, so. Say go. We'll see if they move, move, move assist or not. Let's move both over to monitor and I'm dead. The monitor's good. It's a good card. It's a good card. Nope. I'm going to play another nettle assist. Should I go? We gotta go bigger. Gotta go bigger. Just keep playing stuff. Don't Don't kill me. Just keep playing things. I respect it. Play more things, draw more cards, have more fun. Why win when you can have more fun? Here they come. Uh, so we're going to attack. I'm sorry, we're going to block. And I mean, I don't think of any outs here, but... All right, so these both die. And we're going to shoot the uh, the monitor down. 
as was planned. And we're going to untap and draw another land, which is good. Now we're one mana off of casting Muxus. If I Matron for Prospector... If I Matron for Prospector, it's actually enough. Um, but now I think maybe I can afford to chill for a turn. Yeah, Logobot, if you have a, new, a newer version, I'd love to see it, honestly. If you're, are, you, are you in the Discord? You're a sub. I'd love to see a newer version. They have a counter spell too. That's gross. That's gross. Just have it all. Just have it all. Uh, I mean, now that they have a counter spell, we just like, can't. We actually can't win. Uh, but we'll get an inspector. And we'll like try and kill it on their up. Kill a flyer on their upkeep. Yeah, all right, so I guess they have to actually kill me. Maybe they won't kill me. What's up, Ross? Land. They see the line. They only gave me one extra turn, folks. They wouldn't want to give me another one after that. So that's okay. We missed like three land drops that game. Uh, that happens. We get to bring in the Trash Man because he's the Trash Man. Two braids and... We're going to cut some, uh, patch like mines. We can cut a Muxus. They have counter spells in their deck, honestly. And shave like a Snoop. And shave, honestly, maybe Chieftain. Is Chain Whirler good here? They have like, I don't really have Esper Sentinel. It's probably it. That card's bad against us anyway, so. Is old Monzi good? I don't think Monzi's good. Let's do this. So what would a three Muxus cutting the Chieftains? Yeah, I, that's fair. And cutting Chieftains is reasonable also. How you been, Ross? I'm talking a while. Are you going to any events or anything? You're coming to, you're, you're coming to Philly, right? Philly for the, the convention thing that Todd's doing? Oh, boy. Yeah, it's, it's definitely... It is a little weird, though, for the set championship this weekend because it is standard and historic. And some cards you're playing in both formats don't do the same thing in both formats. Uh, so if you're playing, like, Goldspan Dragon in both Standard and Historic, they're different cards, which is kind of weird, honestly. It's weird. I, I was really on board with all the digital stuff uh, early on, uh, both Alchemy and the uh, the nerfing and buffing of cards. But I'm it's, it's falling out of favor pretty fast for me. Uh, it's just kind of confusing. I don't think it's really serving the purpose. I think that the... The execution on the alchemy front and the buff nerf front is just, like, probably as bad as it could be, honestly. Ah, uh, it sucks for us. Yeah, I don't know what their criteria and stuff is, but I was trying to reach out for uh, for folks. Um, we don't care about Sentinel. or are Wily Goblin. Oh, how about you're playing the PT? And you're playing the, you're playing the Kami War and the PT? Oh, man. What a freaking hero. Folks, don't root for me in the Pro Tour. Root for Alarmo Bot playing the Kami War in the freaking Pro Tour. I think the deck is good. I'm like, I'm, I'm being legit here. Like, I think the deck is actually pretty good. Um, right, we're going to say go here. That's awesome. Not playing until August. What's in August? I know it's coming up, honestly. All right, so Old Sentinel here against my all-creature deck. Portable Hole. The Treasure. Okay. <laughs> Keep the change, you filthy animal. It's gone. I've been robbed. I've been robbed. Um, now they have uh, Rebuke up also. So, yeah, I'm just going to play Prospector and just hold up Expert, I guess. They're going to Rebuke my Skirk Prospector. You got to live your life, right? You got to live your life. My sound clips, my mind, I'm powerful, I'm powerful. What's the commentary game, Ross? I mean, Syracuse is having all their drama about like freaking no vaccinations and stuff, and it's like, I don't know what the hell SG's even doing, so that's really annoying. Um, oh, that's even more annoying. Shadow Spear's really good. We, um, 
probably need to kill this. Apex is invitational? What's that? What's Apex? Alright, we're gonna kill this. Um, uh, I mean, we gotta kill this. They could have a counter spell though, if I try and kill it. I mean, I'm gonna lose a Shadow Spear, so I'm just gonna kill this right now. Awesome store in Ohio, sweet. Ohio's cool, they have Melt in Ohio. Melt's delicious. Uh, yes, I wish to kill your creature. Yes, I wish to attack for one. Don't play an Elsist. Oh no, Grab Digger's Cage. And Thaw Monitor. Alright, sure. You know what time it is, folks? It's time to take out the trash. Still a piece of garbage. Time to take out the trash. Matron. Melt is phenomenal. I miss Melt. I want to get Melt right now. Because he's the trash man. Yay, he's the trash man. Alright, they're popping off a little bit, but sure. That's fine. That's fine. Mog Monday, no big deal. Playing Goblins, having a good day. First time tuning in. Welcome to the stream. Automaton. This card's good. This card's good. And Sentinel. Hmm. All right. I mean, Trash Man's still pretty good here, right? Uh, Trash Man setting up Muxus. Let's go, Rangers Jam. So we're gonna kill. Uh, I mean, obviously Cage. We just kill whatever we want, right? We got Muxus next turn. Hopefully, hopefully. Good time for one one v one challenge. Uh, we can do it after my Monday. I, I actually start, we actually started the stream with one, so. Grab Digger's Cage again, again. You know what? You know. You know what I. You know what I think about you. Shadow Spear. Attack for three, four, five. All right, we're just gonna kill the uh, the monitor. Start. They have one blue up. They do have potential rebuke. I might guess Cranko first. Actually, draw the rebuke out. Bum, bam, ba -da -da. Yeah, they, they got a rebuke here. They got a rebuke. It's funny, I could play around the rebuke by just playing this land untapped. It's probably actually better just get the Cranko in play. Whatever, sure. Play around rebuke, cast, cast Cranko. We'll kill the cages once, once, once it's Muxus time. But for now, like, we can just chill, and like now we're like pretty far ahead. We obviously untap with Cranko and Trash Master. Uh, I believe we, the term is it's on. No! All right, sack this, and we're going to kill, I guess, the Shadow Spear. Now the problem is they probably just have a rebu rebu Rebuke in their hand, so. If we can cast it and, like, see if it resolves, kill cages. If not, whatever. It's out of stock. Oh, it might be because like, there's a there's a, a cooldown on it. Uh, give it a little bit, Thunderwonk. We'll figure it out one way or another. Shadow Spear number two is here. Uh, all right, sure. And they still have their uh, their thing up. All right, casual, sure. Sounds like a Thunder Wonk. What format? All right, I'm going to kill the Atomaton. I'm sure. Sack like this. I'm pretty sure this last card's a rebuke. Um... Based on how things have played out so far. But. Matron's good. I like that. Matron for. What? Standard sounds great. Um. Whatever we. If we get anything good, it's gonna be counter probably. It might actually just be Matron, honestly. Just like chain Matrons with the Trash Master in play. Be Sling Gang. It's Sling Gang's pretty good. Let me get Sling Gang. It's probably not resolving. So here's Sling Gang. They have the rebuke. And I can't let this resolve. Like with the Trash Master employ. How do they kill the Crank on the Trash Master too with that with that with that uh absence? Go on, counter it, you coward. That's what I thought. 
Uh, and now we just attack with Trash Master and say go. Listen, McIntyre, you want to come? You want to come at me? You best not miss, you know? I got streamer luck. I, I'm on stream. I just I can't help it, you know? All right, they're dead. They're dead. I can even kill her lands with Trash Master. That's freaking awesome. All right, we're going to kill... Uh, just kill the monitor. And it's Cranko time, my friends. I screwed up, actually. I should I should I should I should have killed this. <laughs> but I should have I should have not killed this. Now I can't kill these things. That I can sack the muxes, I guess. Uh, let's see, what we draw. So I need to kill both cages too. Up, oh, never mind. We're good. Play bad win anyway. All right, so we're going to. Um, Kill Cage. Literally the perfect draw. Like the actual perfect draw. <laughs> One mana goblin. She's never punished in a million years. Never ever punished. Never punished. Streamer luck. Everybody see what I'm saying? Make it dire to streamer luck. Folks, say it with me. Daddy's home. Friends. 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 Kill it. And they're also just dead. So we're gonna full control, do the old pile driver trick, sack, resolve the Muxus trigger, and then sack this to kill this. Completely unnecessary, but it looks cool for style points. Easy game. Easy game. Yeah, it, it is a lot of bot. It is very funny actually that I agree with you. If the card, the prismatic bridge, was just a card, not the back of that card. That deck would actually be, like, insanely good. I strongly agree. I strongly agree. Sack to kill the lands. Oh, you're right. I screwed up. Hi, I'm Jim. Welcome to the stream. I didn't kill my opponent's lands when I, when I had a chance to. That, that was a big mistake. That was a huge mistake. Are right, they left in their... Uh, their Sentinels. Oh, they also have, like, the... The stupid Doofy. Yeah, let's cut this thing out. Take the Chieftains out. Put in Shane Whirler. Put in Bouch of Mons. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, it is really, really funny that it works like that. Dude, I'm saying this lightly, but you are biggest jackals. Great content. What? Do you mean to say jackass? Um, I'll, I'll accept it. I'll accept it. Jackass! It was jackass! Yes! Great. Appreciate that. Um, yeah, I guess we're going to keep, we got Trash Master, whatever. All right, Treasure Vault, Graph Digger's Cage. I think that's Mog Monday. Don't they know? Don't they know? Uh, oh, my bad yesterday. Oh, my bad. I went, uh, I went 1-2 on the draft in Daisy. My, my deck wasn't bad. It's on Twitter. You can go, go look, 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 at my, look at my Twitter. You can see the, see the deck. But um, it's a good deck. It just, just drew pretty badly. It wasn't a great deck. It was just a fine deck. We, um, I think I want to get the Snoop down. Just try, like, riding that train a little bit. Try and clear my top cards from Goblin stuff. Top cards of land, sure. Black Staff of Waterdeep is a cool card. I don't think it's very good in this deck. I poured all the... All right, well, we have the Trash Master, so we'll work our way up to that. They're also, like, hyper aggro with their freaking, uh... Ooh, Grab Sticker's Cage is a creature now. We can kill it. Uh, Goblin. This, there you go. We'll see what their, uh, what their plans are here. Resolving Trash Master would be exceptionally good for us, obviously. We would get to, uh, kill the Portable Hole and friends. Oh, okay. All right. They're starting the Thought Monitor Train. Play land, attack, no blocks. Would obviously like to kill the cage. Uh, Mux daddy, eh? And Mux father, eh? We're pretty close to that, too. Well, now there's tapped out. We can just resolve Trash Master. Uh, which feels pretty good. I'm just gonna do that. Because he's the Trash Man. Yay! Now we'll, like... Probably blockade, sack goblin, kills hole. Oh, nope, I'm gonna keep going here, sure. 
while we're in the trash for more fodder. I want to have the mana for Mux next turn, possibly. All right. Here they come. We're going to block here and kill the hole. Cool. Get back our uh, our Snoop. Top card's Krenko. Oh my god. How lucky can you be, folks? How lucky can you be? Upkeep. Activate Snoop. They're going to kill Trash Master now's this time. Alright. They're going to Aether Gust the Trash Master. This puts it on top, though, so I can still use it. <laughs> uh, this is fine. Let's resolve this. Put it on top. This resolves for one token. And now if I want to, I can use this without even casting it. They're not blew up anyway, though. It doesn't freaking matter. I think they're just, I think they're just dead. I didn't think they're just dead. Um... And now I get to Cranko again next turn, too. That's sick. Uh, yeah, do I want to use the... We have Experts here, too. I can just, like, Expert and kill their stuff, too, honestly. Maybe just, like, Expert. Uh, kill Monitor. Get their land, too. And then Expert again. And... Why are we, like, waiting here? Kill this. Resolve that. Favorite cheese, Romano. Kill that. And then we're gonna like, I think we're gonna kill, uh, I'm just gonna kill everything, honestly. <laughs> Whatever, just kill everything. Kill, make, make it so they can't Thought Monitor again, basically, you know? Kill that. Kill this, just kill everything. I don't care, it's all gone. It's all gone. Get off my plate. Get out of here. I'm gonna kill Black Staff too, because remember this is not gonna be on top of our deck. We're on our, we're on our draw step right now, so um, so it's gonna kill everything with the uh, the fake Trash Master here and Snoop. Then we're gonna draw for turn. I'm just gonna say go. Next turn we have upkeep make token again, which is great. And they've got nothing. So you get nothing. You Last lose. casket. Good day, sir. Fine. They have mana to counter my Krenko. Uh, whatever, sure. Make them have it. They don't got it. They don't got it. Supposed to cast Expert while Krenko voted on a stack? Yeah, probably. Sure. You're right. I was having too much fun. Alright, I was having too much fun. Crank Dog. Resolves instantly. Uh, I'll play Goblin here. I think this is, like, fine. Just, like, puts a Goblin to play and maintains the treasure, so. So, if I had... Yeah, you're, you're right. I, I just, like, didn't think through my entire turn before I started doing things. So, I should have, uh... Not resolved this trigger and have the things going. Whatever, it's fine. They got one card in hand. Uh, and we can now cast Trash Master with three mana up. They're just dead. That's what I'm talking about! Game. It's Mog Monday, folks. First of all, that follow by watching YouTube. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. We play Goblins every single Monday. Mog, Mog Monday episode 136. Over two years of Mog Monday. Let's go. For those who don't know, I'm playing in the New Capenna Championship this weekend. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, it is the effect, effectively a pro tour, an online pro tour arena. Uh, if I do well, I qualify for Worlds, which is huge. And I'll qualify for some of the paper pro, pro tours next, next year. It's a big event for me. I tested with Team CFB, which is super awesome. And uh, it's a big event, so tune in, make sure you watch it. Uh, like Content Week this week again as I practice for it. Um, historic and Standard. Should be a lot of fun. Should be a lot of fun. So, let's go. Cheeky M80 says, Trash Master ate my booty. <laughs> Cheeky, first time chatter, good game, my friend. The Trash Master, he... Still a piece of he just, he's just, he's just eating booties, I guess. Um, I'm playing one deck in Standard, one deck in Explorer, one deck in Historic. Bunch of fun decks. Let's go, Rangers! <laughs> Alright, so um, we're going to play Den of the Bugbear and say go. Goblins going right now? I mean, goblins are great. They're fun. They're fun. Snoop it up. Opponent's playing food, probably. Which is super lame, but it's fun. Make it work. Good games, Cheeky. Good games. 
Oh no. Ba, ba, ba. There you go. It's fine. It's dead. It's dead. Blooming Marsh. Trail of Crumbs. I mean, Mox is actually pretty good here, right? Um, we have Snoop and Prospector. Let's see our top card is. Top card is a land. We have turn four Muxus. We really want it. We really want it. Nothing? All right. Land on top. Land on top is also a count against playing Muxus because it's one less than we get hit, you know? So this deck also has Massacre too, so need to be aware of these factors as we consider our options here. Um, maybe we want to try and like bait out Massacre for two by playing Slinging Lieutenant. I kind of like that. So let's, uh, let's attack, let's attack here. Let's attack, shock in, land, play Slinging, play Slinging, play Slinging Gang. Kind of want to draw a land for Mux anyway, so. Shock this in. Lieutenant. And they massacre this way, they lose six and gain nothing, so. Or five, sorry. Sling Gang Lieutenant, not CJ Commander. Deadly Dispute. Sack of food. Do the thing. Yada, yada, yada. Who here likes food? Like the deck, not the thing you eat. Because everyone likes food, obviously. Alright, seven cards in hand. And a treasure. I don't like either. <laughs> Says swear holes. I don't like either. Pop quiz, hot shot. Alright, what is it? There's your massacre. Look, I I, I called it. I called it. Alright. Sack the uh the goblins. Alright, so. Sack all this. And now, uh, we've negated the life gain on the Massacre. We're building up to a Goblin Grandee. The question is, what are we going to Matron for? Curse Bound Witch. Sure. Draw land. Matron. Do we want to get, like, a Snoop? He, we could get, like, a... Could get a Wily Goblin here, but that's like puts uh, we're just face up at that point. We get Wily Goblin. Um, we can get a Snoop and keep grinding. It's really it for our options, I think. Or get a second Mux to be super greedy, which is insane, I think. So, um, we probably just want to get the Wily Goblin. I don't know. Maybe get Snoop. I'm gonna get Snoop. Get a Haste Lord? No. We want to either grind for value or set up Mux next turn. One or the other. One or the other. Um, I'm going to get Snoop. Play Snoop. Top card's a land. It's a Cranko. Almost better. Almost. Almost. Like, this forces a kill spell on the Snoop. That's great. You know? Dispute again, sure. Sack the witch, yada yada yada. Do the things. Keeper Mulligan. Cat oven should be banned in historic. Keep or Mulligan? What do y'all think? Cat oven should be banned in historic. Keep or Mulligan? Upkeep. Activate Cranko. Draw. Top cards of land. Um. I mean, I'm going to Cranko here, try and draw out a, uh, a Meter Massacre, and then we're going to cast Muxus on an empty board. What do y'all think? What do y'all think? Historic is pretty stale. Uh, I will say, have you put a lot of prep into Historic? Obviously, this this the last two weeks for the uh, main deck Witch's Vengeance. Get the out of here. What? Are you kidding me? How can you do this to me? It's Mog... It's Mog Monday! Hello, darkness, my old friend. You know what that means, folks. Now I'm mad. And when I, when I get mad... Listen, listen. I don't get mad. I get stabby. Alright. Let's see. Here, here we go. Say it with me, chat. Daddy's home. 
Boom. And that wasn't as good as it looked, unfortunately. It's all right, though. It's all right. It's a rebuy. It's a rebuy. So we have Matron for Moxus again. We could get Haste Lord, but that's pretty bad, so. Oh, it was from the witch. Right. All right. You're right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. All right. You're right. You're right. It was the drafted card from the witch. They're not playing main deck, which is Vengeance. They're not, they're not an actual insane person. Uh, insane person. All right. And then we're uh, just going to stay go here. No reason to like... We could cast another Muxus here. There's no point in doing that. Just chill. Make them, make them have Massacre again. If they do, we have Muxus. If they don't, we're talking for a million. So... Zoe, I know, right? I, I, I thought they were dead like twice that game. And the series too, honestly. All right, here's Lurus. Recast the Witch. Okay, sure. All right. Sack to Phyrexian Tower for two black. Another vengeance. No, that was a, uh, that was a, uh, Me. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? So those don't know how this mechanic works, right? This is the spellbook mechanic. Uh, this card says when it dies, draft a card from the spellbook. There are 15 cards in the spellbook, and you get to draft from three of them. So you're one in five to hit Vengeance both times. So they hit one in five, and then one in five again. Look on a mask with my boy. It's all right. It's all right. I ain't done yet. Phyrexian Tower. Awesome. Sack Muxus. Let's do it, folks. Here we go. Third time's a charm. Second time? Third time? I don't even know what it is. Say it, chat. Daddy's home. This Muxus reveals... <sighs> Two more Muxes? Come on. <laughs> why are you like this? Why why is it gotta be like this? They they draft two vengeance and I hit I hit a million uh a million and now now both Muxes are on the bottom of my deck too. Oh my god. This is unbelievable. I can't believe this is happening. <sighs> How could this happen to me? Curse Bound Witch, yeah. Four cards in hand, Phyrexian. They just have like Phyrexian Tower plus Lurus every turn. Lurus, Curse Bound Witch. I mean, we're out right, right of Muxus now, so now it's, uh, now we're probably just dead. Uh, both Mux from the bottom of our deck. And we've been betrayed. Betrayed here on Mog Monday. A betrayal most foul. A betrayal most foul. Now, this time they hit Curse of Leeches. This is a 3 man enchantment. Uh, lose one, and then it can flip over to a lifelinker. All right, sure. Shock in a land. Play Oven. All right. I mean, we can draw Matron, I guess. For the reshovel. Chieftain? That's not bad. That's not bad. Just gotta go for the attack here, I guess. Whatever, right? No. Alright. Oh, the average doesn't get it. Doesn't understand. Bugbear. Two cards in hand. What's the worst that could happen, you know? What's the worst that could happen? Huh? So whenever you trigger, when the curse bound dies, you draft from the spell book. Uh, so you get you see you see three of those fifteen cards and pick one. They kill Muxus. This is still a pretty good attack, honestly. Like, like we actually want Lurus to block. So All right, they're at thirteen, and they say go. Matron's the best possible draw. 
I'm giving it both mucks on the bottom of our deck. It's pretty stock. Mortality Spear. Just a pretty common card in these decks. It's a very stock Golgari food deck, if you haven't seen it. What's up, F? How'd the weekend go? It was a great weekend. I submitted my Pro Tour deck list. The Rangers won, most importantly. I had the Terrible in the Arena, but I don't really care that much, honestly. Uh, they have Familiar now, too. That's just lame. Let's go to the next game. Alright, whatever. I'll just see it. Actually, I'll, 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 I'll more shot from Muxus, I guess. In for three. Game three. Curse Bound Witch. Are they going to sack it and go for the Vengeance? Yeah, they definitely are. Oh, do it to me. Do it to me. Hurt me. Hurt me. Here, F6. Do your thing. Do your thing. Nope. No? No? Do it now. Slow roll. Do it last. No. I'm, I'm just gonna see what Alright, they you win. You got me. Alright, you got me. Mux has let me down. Mux has let me down. So we're gonna bring in um bring in what? Herald's horn. They have like massacres, like infinite blockers, um Chain Whirler. Not great. I don't really care about their whole food thing that much. Bring the horns. Shave like Pashik Mons and like some Chieftains, maybe. Uh, we don't want Thoughtsies. We don't want Thoughtsies. We want to do our thing, you know? Gonna shave like a Prospector or two. Maybe bring in like Chandra, Ringleader. I don't want Prospector. Uh, and this is like fine. Honestly, like, we should probably be able to outgrind them. Uh, because, like, our grind leads into, like, a Muxus, which should be enough to win the game, so. Alright, so, uh, sure. Not great, but fun. But fun. Thoughts is just a logical sideboarding, I think. Um, we're not, like, there's no key card to their plan we need to Thought Seize. Just doing our plan is fine. So. Some Landos. Little uh, little Kalani Garden, which is fun. They're going to Thought Seize us. We got a Deuce. The games get this is like are very long. They are very, very long. Kind of take forever. I agree. Wait, what? Where y'all going? What? What's? Bye. Thanks for coming. All right, play goose. Oh, straight out. I got dad ball tonight. I skipped last week's dad ball to watch the Ranger game. That was the game I lost like seven nothing or whatever. Um. All right. Yeah. I mean, we're not really doing much here, but sure, I guess. Ooh. Phyrexian Tower, sure. Lure us to hand. All right, sure. Like the sound effects, it makes me giggle. Aww. Thanks. Yes, citizen. Um, we're just going to say go. Nope, that's another land. I'm going to cycle this. Like. Season it, resub. Thanks so much. Another expert. Kill me here. Squats, let's go. Everyone stand up. Everyone stand up. Stretch. Let's go, Rangers. Ravenous Squirrel. They have a Gilded Goose in play. They have Phyrexian Tower. They have Oven now. Yeah, we can't kill this, I don't think. Um, Herald's Horn. They have... Three ways to sacrifice things. We can't, we can't kill a squirrel here. Uh, wait. One, two, three, four. Sack one. Two mana for the food. Uh, no, that, that, that's a double sack. 
So to ban it, it's like this. They like select creature. It's like the food. We actually can kill it. Yeah, that's true. Uh, all right, let's try and kill it. Oh shit! Full control. Full control. Target this. See what they do. I'll pass priority. No reason to do it yet. No reason to do it yet. Sacrifice the thingy. And we're going to do it again. And then maybe they'll screw up. Yeah, sorry. We delayed so long from the uh, event. Target you. Submit. Now, let's see if they screw up here. Yeah, they're going to screw up. Nope, they have Fatal Push. Oh, that's, that's bad. They still need to stack one thing here, though. So, they're going to get it. But, we got two Muxes in our hand. Whatever, it's fine. Squats time. One. Everyone stand up and do it. Two, come on. You're at your desk right now. You get your ass up. Want to have that burrito for lunch. Earn it. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I hate squats. I hate them. Oh. I am Khan. Platypus walks? I know what that is. I know what that is. Lamp, please. Please your land. Devil dispute, sacking a goose. Sure. We need a big mux next turn, folks. We need a big mux this. The lurks in their hand already. Jeez. Oh, look familiar. Yes. Say it, folks. Daddy's home. That's pretty good. Um, top card is a matron. This would deal four. And the Muxus can attack safely. They can sacrifice one, two, three, four. We can't, we can't, we can't, 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 can't kill a squirrel. Kill this. We have Muxus again next turn, too. They got two cards in hand. Sweet. Just do the thing. This matter doesn't feel that bad, honestly. Like, just casting Mox is like a pretty reasonable thing to do. Alright, so they have a Mortality Spear. And they're going to kill my War Chief or my Mox. I'm going to kill. Might just die to the freaking... Uh, Squirrel next turn. Never mind. Alright. Uh, Mux is next turn. Mux is next turn. There's always next turn. There's always next turn. Called her familiar. Do the thing. Blah, 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 blah. Play Lurus. Play Goose. Top card is Goblin Ringleader. We could just go Herald Tor and Goblin Ringleader. That's not bad, actually. Um, just, like, hold off for a turn. I don't hate it. Um, I'm going to do that. We have Matron, so they draw Thoughtseize. We're still good. Name Goblin. Ringleader off the top. Ringleader reveals. Another Mux is in a Sling Gang. Okay. Okay, no attacks. Top card's a land, sure. Yada, yada, yada. Do the things. Tough Fizz. I did bad. Folks, you to follow me on Twitter. I posted the deck list, my results on Twitter and stuff.
the follow button, folks. Follow me and everything. Articles up on CoolStuffInc.com. The Rangers. Michael. Zabernagerd. The game tying gold. Like four minutes left. It's big. It's big last night. Exciting game. All right. Fall asleep over here. Help, I got All right, you have fourteen fourteen. It's cool. F's and chat for um for Maple Leaf fans. F's and chat. It's fun, right? It's good. It's fun. Later, uh, Galrong. You're great. Thanks for hanging out. It's a big squirrel. It's a big squirrel. I don't know how a squirrel gets bigger than Emmercool, but ask her before. Right, we're just dead. We're just dead. All right, you win. Right, fun, fun match. Fun match. Uh, 101. 101. All right, no food, please. He lay Moxes. We're dead. We were dead to the massacre, so... T1 Creator says, Hey Jim, I'm playing Arena for a month. I watched your entire Kamigawa Bronze to Mythic and just hit Mythic rank on premium Capenna Draft. Oh, Let's hear it for uh, oh T1 God. Creator. Congrats. That's impressive. Play Magic for a month? Play Magic for a month or Arena for a month? No two lander. No two lander. Uh... Yeah, sure. Whatever. We got Wally Gob. We'll figure it out. Let's draw land. Straw land. Lair of the Hail Hydra, land or else. Draw a non land. Alright. Alright, come on now. Come on. We got some gruel. Ah, that was a cool little desert animation. Burning tree emissary. Alright. Alright. Faceless agent. That's the shaman's deck. It's a 2-2 two -two now. They buffed it. I forgot. Uh, I mean, don't draw a land. We're in trouble. All right. I should probably just mulling it, honestly. But whatever. Uh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. I don't want to use the treasure. Whatever. Sure. Sure. What's up, Merch Boy Todd? What event working for CFB? Uh, New Capenna Set Championship this weekend. Basically an online pro tour. Standard Historic. I did not see the Gobbleaki Top 8 of the Legacy Challenge. I'll, pop, I'll play that next week. That's a good idea. Oh, sweet. That's awesome, Creator. Yeah, that's, that's very impressive. That's awesome. Harmonic Prodigy doubles your Shaman triggers. And then you get a Shaman in play. Sure. So, we're going to lose this game horribly and then board into... Uh, our chain whirler and actually have lands and win the game easily. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just gonna see you dead. Next game. Next game. I should have mulligan. I should have mulligan. You gotta make your land drops, you know? So we're gonna bring in chain whirler, a braid, a braid. Uh, that's it. And we're gonna cut probably just like two chieftains, honestly. Could be a snoop. I'll call like a snoop and a chieftain. Or a snoop and two chieftains. Sure, I, I like that. Kill stuff. Play Moxus. No, no, no. I think for Pro Tours isn't fun. It is fun, but it's tiring. Argo! Reset, thanks so much. Let's go, Rangers. Uh, it's a keeper. We are going to. We get a slew on one. Yeah, because we, we can't even. Uh, we can't go Bugbear one and then land on two anyway, so.
Quality of life concession, exactly. Alright. Dragon School Summit. Just gonna cast the fast Muxus this game. Turn four Muxus here? Just do our thing? Just do our thing? Big thanks to everyone who ordered the Goblin Token. Uh, it's over. You can't order anymore. That's it. It's done. You missed it. Which is sad, unfortunately, but... Don't worry. Lionel Ralphs, sure. Rootbound Crag, sure. Chain Whirler, where art thou? Um, yeah, we should cast Moxus next turn or whatever. You're up! You're up! Do I anticipate to, do I anticipate to keep Chain the other Pro Tours from now on? Uh, no. I mean... Pro-level magic for a full-time content creator is a luxury. Uh, you know, if I play in events, cool. If I do well, cool. Uh, I did work very hard at this event because I, I have a chance for Worlds, which is a thing I can't really, like, pass up. But my focus is still content creation. You know, I, I, gotta, I gotta pay the bills. You know, I gotta pay the bills. So, you know, I did very well in the last Pro Tour. I top eight, which is super awesome. I won $5,000. You know, that's $5,000 is great. Don't get me wrong, but that's not, like, making money to, you know, to support myself money. Uh, on, an, on an inconsistent basis. So, they're going to kill my stuff, but I still have start next turn anyway, so. Did you miss your sad about it? Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. I tried to make it, I, I constantly talked about it for like two weeks as much as I could, so. All right, folks, here we go. Daddy's home. Okay, good, good. No uh, haste effect, but still good. Still good. Do I still teach math? Uh, no. I don't teach math. I never have taught math. I don't even like math. Uh -huh. And new Teach Me Human album. Uh, they Brian works on stuff intermittently. You can go go follow Teach Me Human on Spotify. Uh, he releases singles and stuff like that whenever he wants to. What's up, Coral? Um, yeah, run it back. Coral says, to be honest, Jim, the way you're doing it feels better than before when you're grinding. I seem way happier than I was on the SG Tour. Yeah, when I was doing my SG Tour stuff, I was trying to play full-time competitive magic, be a full-time content creator, and run a magic team all at the same time, and I was doing every one of those things badly. So, so uh, yeah, gotta just do things right. This is a two-lander, but we're on the draw with a goblin and a braid. I'm gonna keep this. We need to draw a land, but we're on the draw too, so... I'll slap base. I'll play pick base. Ace pick. Play some base for you if you want. I have a good read in English, correct. If I see... Pile driver emotes in chat from 20 different people, I will break out the base. Drew land, sicko. This card's a goblin. That's a goblin. Um, I'm going to kill that right now. Play base reward? I do. I do, actually. Channel point, uh, for 80,000 channel points, I'll, I'll write you a song. 80,000 channel points. Face this agent, draws a card. We've got... Pashalik Mons? Um... Yeah, we can Mons it. That's fine. Mons it. I haven't played bass in a while. I haven't played bass in a while. Get to the sub. Thanks, Coral. That was a bad turn for us. They accompanied into double rage forger. Uh Okay. We um We're still like okay here, honestly. We can play this. Goblin and then expert down one of the rage forgers. 
and just like blocks the log against Moxie next turn. It's not bad. It's not bad. So there you go. Oh man, I haven't played so long. So we have to deal two damage. We can deal to the just to them, and they attack with the Rage Forge. We block with the Patrick Mons and trade. Well, I guess now they can attack with just the four four. Sure, that's fine too, though. Honestly, whatever. Anyone name that soon? Anyone name that soon? Name that soon. First person to name that tune, I'll, I'll gift a sub to. If you're not a sub. First person to name that tune, I'll, I'll gift a sub to you. Alright, it's Mux's time. It's Mux's time. Let's go! We're five. It's not Carol's Whisper now. We had two Muxes again? Somebody's playing a prank on me. Uh. You know it, but you're subbed. Good job not spoiling it. I'm so old, and no one knows the song anymore. Ah, oh, crap, are you dead? Smoke on the water. Play it again? Sure, I'll play it again in one second. So, we're going to one here, but we have Sling Gang Cranko. Um, when these die, nothing, nothing bad happens. But this here, this here. Dutch boy, no. Tried to remind everyone. And that one here. I think we're okay here. We're about the sling gang combo, basically. Land red sling gang cranko. Oh, yeah, let's go. And attack. Are we dead? Right, it's 14. There's dead. No, there's dead on board. The old Sling Gang Pashlik Mons Wombo combo. Sack this. Deal one. Wish I could, like, auto make it do this while I uh, play base. Let's go! I agree. They should errata a sling out tenant like artist. I agree. You're not targeting yourself with it. Like, there we go. After it was all over, he took us in the house of service pancakes. Mog Monday. In the books. We went 2 and 1. We lost the food. Uh, whatever. That deck's stupid anyway. Um. And, uh, yeah, we have more matches to play. But, um, I'm going to call it Mog Monday. So, we have more, more matches to play. On stream, we have three fun, three very, very fun decks to play. One for each format: uh, historic, uh, historic, standard, and explore. But Mog Monday, Goblins is fine. Uh, Goblins is fine. It's definitely not the best deck in the world. Uh, it used to be one of the best decks in historic. Is no longer the best deck in historic, but it's still a good deck. Still a good deck. Uh, I might play three Muxes, honestly. Um, just a little less efficient than it used to be. Obviously, you can't just like jam it every time. And hitting mucks on mucks sucks too, but there's your deck. Mod Monday, YouTube folks, love you, like, comment, subscribe. Thanks, YouTube.